Hi there, I'm Tommy and I love adventures. Today, while playing in the park, I dug up something incredible in the sandbox. It was big, oval and shone like a pearl under the sun. It looked just like a giant egg. I couldn't believe my eyes. Could it be a dinosaur egg? I decided to take it home to find out more. Back at home, I carefully cleaned the egg and placed it on my windowsill. Suddenly, that night, as moonlight hit the egg, it started to crack. To my amazement, a tiny dinosaur peeked out, blinking at the new world. It was a real live dinosaur. A baby triceratops, I think. I decided to call him Dino. He looked around curiously and seemed very friendly. Dino seemed a bit sad and homesick. Wondering how I could help, I wished really hard that I could show him his home. Suddenly, my room transformed. Trees grew from the floors, ferns sprang from the walls, and a prehistoric sun shone brightly. We had travelled back in time to the age of dinosaurs. Wow! I exclaimed. We're going to explore your world, Dino. Our first encounter in this ancient world was with a group of gentle herbivores. A giant Brachiosaurus munched on tree leaves above us, its neck stretching like a skyscraper. Nearby, a herd of Stegosaurus wandered, their plated backs shining in the sun. I approached cautiously, and they seemed just as curious about me as I was about them. Next, we made our way to a sparkling blue lake, a watering hole for the dinosaurs. Pterosaurs glided gracefully overhead, their wings casting shadows over us. At the water's edge, shy Parasaurolophus dipped their heads to drink, their long, curved crests echoing their soft calls. Dino tugged at my shirt, urging me to join him as he splashed joyfully in the waiter. Our peaceful exploration was suddenly interrupted by a thunderous roar. From behind a clump of trees, a massive Tyrannosaurus Rex emerged. My heart raced with fear, but to my surprise, the T-Rex was not menacing. Instead, it seemed playful and curious about Dino. It turned out, he just wanted to play a game of hide-and-seek among the giant ferns. As the sun began to set over the prehistoric landscape, it was time to return to our own time. Dino and his new dinosaur friends gathered around to say goodbye. Each of them, even the mighty T-Rex, gave a gentle nuzzle or a friendly roar as farewell. I promised Dino and his friends that I would visit again soon. With a heavy heart, I made one last wish to go home. In a blink, Dino and I were back in my room. The big adventure felt like a dream, but the muddy footprints on my floor and a small feather from a pterosaur that Dino clutched in his little hands told me it was all real. I tucked Dino into bed beside me and drifted off to sleep, dreaming of our next big adventure together in the land of dinosaurs.